Surgery and radiation have been the treatments of choice for management of prostate cancer for decades. Despite technical advantages in both, men risk being left with either erectile dysfunction or incontinence. If you're one of these patients, rest assured that you're not alone. Statistics show that after surgery, 5% of patients suffer from significant incontinence requiring multiple pads per day. A higher percentage will suffer from minor urinary control complaints and over 50% will complain of erectile dysfunction. At the Michigan Institute of Urology, we pride ourselves in our ability to offer our patients the most comprehensive, the most effective, and the most innovative treatment options available. Erectile dysfunction after radical prostatectomy, even by experienced surgeons at centers of excellence, ranges from 40 to 85%. Statistics for most community urologists demonstrate the return to erectile function ranges from only 9% to 40%. To help you offer, uh, to help you with this, we offer a variety of treatment options. To begin with, pills such as Viagra, Cialis, or Levitra, and Staxin, vacuum constriction devices, or intraurethral suppository devices, or injections, can all dramatically increase blood flow. We often integrate these with a comprehensive ED rehab program that is highly effective in restoring sexual function. For those men who have tried these options, yet still suffer from ED as long as two years after surgery, we offer state-of-the-art penile implants. This is an outpatient procedure with an excellent success rate. Are you suffering from reduced urinary control after your prostate cancer treatment? Up to one-third of men do, and we can fix that too. Treatments include pelvic floor rehabilitation through Kegel exercises, physiotherapy, and electrical muscle stimulation therapy. Pills will further help control the overactive bladder, but if these don't help sufficiently, we can still correct most everyone's incontinence with one of two excellent techniques. For most incontinence, we prefer the male urethral sling. This is a minimally invasive outpatient procedure in which a mesh device is used to suspend and compress the urethra. It's done under an hour and as an outpatient, and it works successfully in well over 90% of cases. For those with more significant incontinence, we will choose the artificial urinary sphincter. This discrete, implanted, patient-controlled technology will cure or greatly improve well over 80% of major incontinence cases. Don't suffer from erectile dysfunction or incontinence after your prostate treatment. We are here to help you. Find out more from me or through our website you deserve a good quality of life. We at MIU are committed to help you get it.